Hi Potassium, welcome back to Storytime. I hope you guys are having a great day. Today we're gonna read a very exciting story called Tiger in My Soup. Let's go ahead and get started. Tiger in My Soup by Kashmira Sheth and illustrated by Jeffrey Ewer. Today my big sister is in charge of the house, the lunch, and me. I hold up my book. Will you read to me? I ask. Not now, she says. I look at the pictures by myself. Down, side up, and upside down. Front to back and back to front, with my eyes open and with my eyes closed. But it's no fun doing it by myself. Will you read my book to me? I ask again. It's about tigers. Big hungry tigers. My sister doesn't answer. I try something else. I'm hungry! This time she hears me. My sister gives me a bowl of soup for lunch. Be careful, she says. It's hot. While the soup cools, will you read to me? I beg. Later, she says. He's having no luck, is he? I stir my soup. Something steamy puffs up. A tiger! There's a tiger in my soup! I drop my spoon. I glance at my sister. Help! Grrr, she grumbles. She hands me a clean spoon. The tiger looks really mad. I have to protect myself. I stab at him with my spoon. Some tiger spit lands on my face. <laughs> this means war. I launch a missile at the tiger right on target. Where did he go? My sister looks up from her book. Why'd you let your soup get cold, she asks. Here, I'll warm it up. Look out for the tiger! It's too late. The tiger's muffled roar rumbles from inside the microwave. <clears throat> Hide, I yell, it's a big hungry tiger! Okay, my sister sighs. Where's your book? I hand it to her and she begins to read. In the hot, steamy jungle, there was a loud roar. No, no, I say. You have to roar like a tiger. Grrr. I eat my soup and keep my, one eye on my sister. I wonder where the tiger will show up next. The end. I hope you guys enjoyed the story. Have a great day. See you guys next time.